So whether you work with calculated uh, data or or um, inputted uh, time series data that you would like to smooth, just remove uh, noisy uh, data, there is one trick that you might like to to uh, to know about. Uh, so obviously a lot of you, and that's also been covered in previous Tip Tuesday videos, uh, you know how to smooth both the inputted uh, production data or calculate the bottom of pressure, which is great. Like uh, like in this case, I'm using a sampling frequency and a moving average of 10. I might change this to, to, to five, uh, and we see that I can use this custom bottom of pressure instead of using uh, the blue points. Uh, but let's say you would actually like to use all the calculated data, but you just would like to remove a few out, uh, outlier points. And what you can go ahead and do then is just to click one here in sampling frequency, click uh, auto fit like uh, this, and then you see all of these uh, outlier points here. Maybe you would like to remove them. And then you can go in and use this lasso remove point option right here. Okay, so if you click that guy, you can simply just lasso all the points that you uh, don't like, that you kind of visually see as, uh, as outlier points. And when you're happy with your uh, selection, you just group all of them and remove them like that. And you can do the same uh, also uh, below uh, the line right here. And I'm just showing you simple example uh, right uh, here in this in this case and when you're happy with uh, with your selection and click save your custom bottom of pressure would now almost every single day honor the calculated data uh, but it just has removed all those crazy outlier points which you see here in the Bextrum bills just as an example